Only on five, the plan to add a pedestrian cycling path on the Harahan Bridge connecting downtown Memphis to West Memphis suddenly has become a much bigger deal. We've learned a reception will be held Wednesday to announce something called the Big River Strategic Initiative. The mayors of Memphis and Shelby County will announce the National Geographic Society seeks to create a geotourism destination running the entire length of the Mississippi River with the Big River crossing the Harahan Bridge as a focal point. The dream is to create Big River Parkway with a paved cycling path on the levees alongside the Mississippi River. The National Geographic Society proposes creation of a geotourism map guide of destinations along the river with smartphone apps and an interactive website. The National Geographic Society says its brand and vast consumer reach will bring immediate attention to the Big River Strategic Initiative. If successful, proponents say Memphis and the Mid-South could become a world-class cycling tourism destination with cyclists riding the length of the river. of rolling on the river, but rolling alongside the river could bring a boom of cycling tourism to Memphis in the Mid-South in the not-too-distant future. Key players in the vision have united to help create the Big River Parkway, a cycling and pedestrian pathway atop river levees extending the entire length of the mighty Mississippi from Minnesota all the way to the Gulf of Mexico. The vision is grand, new pathways to be paved on top of existing levee roadbeds. But it'll take many approvals from agencies like the St. Francis Levee District of Arkansas. Union Pacific Railroad owns the Harahan Bridge. A top rail executive says Memphis leaders made a compelling case for adding a pedestrian cycling pathway on the span connecting Memphis to Arkansas. On both sides of the river, but particularly here in Memphis, public officials, private community leaders, taken the time to think about it and approach us in a way that made it attractive to us. Memphis businessman Charles McVeigh united the power players in the Big River Parkway dream, including the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, which oversees the river. We're uh, passionate about anything uh, that will help uh, the visibility of the Mississippi River and, and the great value that it brings to this nation. Terry Easton now manages the Big River Strategic Initiative. The goal of this project is to make the Mississippi River a global tourism icon. It may be ambitious, but the dream is to open the Big River Crossing on the Harahan Bridge in March 2016 and simultaneously open the initial leg of the Big River Parkway from Memphis all the way to New Orleans.